All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are in quarantine, but we're still working on a new year, new you. What we're going to do is we're going to just show you some exercises. Uh, Brandy's going to show you the exercises we're going to do. As I sit down, I will explain what exercises, what they are, and then we'll go from there and what we can use. All right. This one is called ball and chair, guys. Chain? I mean. Ball and chair. Ball and chain. Yeah, she's my <laughs> ball and chain I, have, chain I have here. What we're going to do is the great thing about this exercise is you do it with a partner. Uh, we were talking moms with kids at home or mom and dad together at home. They do it with a partner. And the great thing about this exercise is we've got a chair and we've got a medicine ball here, the handball back and forth. But you can use a soccer ball, a any kind of ball that you have, soccer ball, basketball, basketball any kind of ball that you have. Uh, it, it's the motion that really counts. What we're going to do is we are going to do the first one, which is we're going to rotate the same way. Keeping your butt on the chair. Keeping your butt on the chair. We're going to rotate. We're going to hand the ball back and forth. The idea is to do 10 full rotations, and you'll see what – and. And then we're going to do three sets. We're going to only do one set, but we want to show you how to do one full set. And the idea is to do three sets of ten at a time. Okay, ready? Here we're going to start. Go. There's one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven, eight, nine, here's ten, and ten. All right, guys. The next one we're gonna do is we're gonna hand the ball off over top, over our heads. Okay, ready? One. There's one. I'm gonna hand it back to her. She's gonna hand it back to me. There's two. Hand it to Brandy. She hands it to me. Three. Four. Very important to keep your back straight. Belly five, squeezed. Six. Try not to shut your shoulders. Seven. <laughs> eight. What was that? <laughs> Did I up? Uh, nine. And ten. Good. She can give her the ball back. All right. The next thing, it may take us a second to line up the camera. We're going to remove the chairs. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to do a one-handed toss or a one-handed chest pass. All right. Now, a couple of things. Hand it, hand it through me the ball. Huh? I just want to. I just want to show what uh, what we're going to do. As you can see, our feet are going to be square, lined up with each other. A little over. A little over. Uh, Outside your, outside your hips, and what we're going to do is we're going to do a little rotation here, and then rotate through, and as we rotate through, we're going to extend that arm and toss the ball to each other. Ten sets with each arm, or ten, ten reps with each arm. Ready? One. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Other arm. Ready? Now, you got to be careful. Brandy and I are right and left handed. That's why that one looks so well. Because <laughs> yeah, I'm left handed, she's right. Now we're using the arms that we're not so not so versed in, so you might have to concentrate. If you're right handed and losing your left arm, using your left arm, you might have to concentrate just a little bit more. We're going to try it again. Ready? One. Two. Three. Four. Five, 
six, seven, eight, nine, <laughs> ten. All right. Next thing is going to be just a straight chest pass. I'm going to hold the ball here. See my, how my hands are? Hold the ball here. It's a straight pass, and we're going to extend our arms all the way out. There you go. Ten to two. Three. Four. Five. five six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. All right, guys. Those. Uh, the last thing you can do is what I like to do. I do it with my personal training clients, and they'll tell you they love it. Kids love it's, it, too. Kids would love it, too. It is, let me get in the picture a little bit. It is slams. Up above the head, on the toes, bring it back down. This ball's a little bit bouncy. Bring it back down. What we want to do, guys, is Brandon and I use a medicine ball because we have one here. If you don't, like I said, you can use a, let's get in this ring a little bit. How about here, right here. I'm in it. Perfect. <laughs> but uh, we want to do, we do a medicine ball. But if you want to, like I said, use a soccer ball, use a basketball, something that you have at the home. If you need, if it doesn't seem like you're doing enough, you don't have to do 10. You can do 15 reps. You can do 20 reps. The idea is to keep moving. Um, suggest we, it 10 reps times 3. Yep, 10 reps, 3 sets of 10 reps is what we suggest. Um and you can increase that, like you said, if uh, if you're uh, if you're if it's too easy for you. If you're using a ball, it's too light. So what the idea of these workouts are, guys, is to just to keep you moving. With the gyms being closed and everything being closed, we got to look for a place. Or, and it being rainy. And it being rainy outside, uh, we got to look for something. You know, maybe whether you got some room in the living room, got a little room in the basement, like we are. We're in our basement. We've got to look out a little workout area here. So. That's the idea, guys. It's just to keep moving. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you for doing this with us. And it's funner with a partner. Yes, it's always fun, always more fun with a partner. And with uh, with that, we will see you again soon with some more we'll videos. Have another video. Yep. Thank you, guys. Have a great day.